to begin to study through the meditation he has to listen to his inner voice that's the first step and to keep these things but telling the inner voice and to work with them and the second thing is learn to see to hear to feel to speak on a very clear way and then the meditation themselves and if the meditation is done after some years if the meditation is coming clear and uh, clear and good uh, then the human can go a step higher and then he can do the initiation and this means he can begin to start to talk with his inner voice with his consciousness consciousness <laughs> <laughs> and with the spiritual part in him Bill, are you still having contacts with sannyasi? Uh, the contact with sannyasi ended uh, on eighty four. Then she left our planet and left our universe to the doll universe and there she is now living for the next seventy or seventy two years without any returning to our universe. The contact with Semyazi, they are also gone, but uh, still there is uh, sporadic contact with uh, Da, with uh, Quetzal, Dalida, and all them. Did Semyazi have contacts with uh, anybody else while she was here? No, no. The single contact uh, Semyazi had all the time she was on earth was with me only. Do any of the other Pleiadians have contacts with people on earth? Uh, not on a way that uh, the contact person knows that there is a contact. The people there are between 24,000 and 25,000 people around the earth who get contact impulses from Pleiadian and Bavi people. Bavi uh, is uh, a Ras who is uh, working since very old time together with the Pleiadians. And also 24, 25,000 people have uh, contact on impulse pass uh, this. Also they don't know anything about that that they have contact that they get, uh, get impulses from outside from aliens. Not any one of them. And there was Two other persons in Germany, they had a telepathic contact to the Pleiadians, not by Semyase. There was uh, some other people responsible for them, but these two people, a man and a 16-year-old girl, they died in the meantime. They had an accident in uh, Italy. And uh,
the, the reason for that stuff is to, to people have contact, telepathic contact with the Pleiadians, was this because they should come to inform the people about my mission that everything I'm bringing is true and that I'm working on this mission with the Pleiadians. They was something like uh, uh, a proof for me, but they died by an accident. And now I'm the single one who has telepathic contact with the Pleiadians and physical contact. And there is no any connection between uh, the Pleiadians and any other earth human being, if man, if child, or if woman. There is just really nothing. And each one who, who, who comes and say, uh, oh, I have contact with uh, someone from, from uh, the Pleiadians, from that uh, planet or from that sun system, from the Ple uh, Pleiades and all this, that's all, uh, what you say, uh, swindle, hoax. Nonsense. Nonsense. <laughs> One of our favorite words. Yeah. <coughs> there is around the world not any one person more without me. And the other thing, what all they who say that they have contact with the Pleiadians don't know, is this, the Pleiades, what you can see, on the on, on, on the night firmament, there is not any possibility for human to live there. The planet is what you can see on the sky. They are too young as they can carry life. The planets, they are there, they are so young, there is no life possible on it. Too not by the suns, they are too young, they are really blue. And that's the thing, what all they who say, oh, I have contact with Pleiadians, not knows. There is not one human being there up on the Pleiadians. Nobody home. <laughs> no. <laughs> um, Pleiadians, the Pleiadians, they say that they are coming from the Pleiades. They say this about that point. They have a second part uh, a, a little part or a short part of a second different time out of our time of our room and our space a point where are the, the Pleiades you know uh, if here are the Pleiades we can see on the sky. There are in other room space, other planets, and they call them by the same names, what we call the Pleiades, what we can see from here on the sky. But it's in other room time, much more finer, than our room time and room space. And 